Good morning, Reedsville Elementary and Middle School. Today is Tuesday, March 31st, 2020. Hard to believe it's the last day of March today, uh, but let's get this day going in the right fashion. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Just one birthday out there today. Happy birthday to Marshall in fifth grade. Marshall, I hope you have a fantastic day today. On the lunch menu, we have a garden salad with chicken, beef sticks, buttered bread slice, uh, fresh kiwi and milk, and tomorrow looks like chips with salsa and bean dip, a hard-boiled egg, applesauce, carrots, and milk. A couple announcements out there today. Uh, students continue working, and as you complete those packets of information, I'll be working hard on the packets that have given to us uh, by our teachers here at the Nate House. Uh, keep those things in a separate folder or in a different side of the folder. Uh, we are working on a second pickup coming up probably towards the end of April. Uh, we can turn those things in and, and give them to the teachers to see all the great things that we have been doing. Uh, you can always pick up a book as well. That's always important to keep reading. The teachers are doing a great job posting lessons and activities uh, on um, either their Facebook closed group or their Google Classroom. I know that they've been reaching out to students as well as part of uh, their expectation um, from the school district is to continue reaching out to the parents and families to see what kind of needs you might have. So look for those phone calls to come through as well. We had two uh, fantastic staff meetings yesterday. Uh, it was great to see the staff together um, and we had some great conversations about student learning. We are working to establish the middle school Chromebook handout at some point coming up. The second round of what I'm calling 4K through 4th grade packet handout um, probably later in April. Uh, and consistent office hours for our teachers and for our students and our parents uh, so that you know when our teachers are available to have conversations. Uh, so again, as we develop those things, keep looking out there for uh, on the S'more newsletter and on the Facebook closed groups for that information. A shout out today to Mrs. Hansen, uh, our middle school art teacher for, for providing an online virtual museum field trip activity. It is a great activity. You can click on the link and find some great museums and some awesome art pieces that are in front of you. Uh, this interactive site for students allows you to visit museums throughout the world. So check out that on the S'more uh, newsletter as well. Mrs. Poppy, our speech therapist, also posted a new activity. It's a great flashlight activity that has been posted uh, to, the new, to the newsletter as well. Check that out. That's a great activity for you to do um, in the next couple of days. Uh, we are also, exciting news here, looking to finalize our distance learning dress-up week for next week. Um, the theme will surround the word kindness. Uh, some great dress-up days being planned. Mrs. Bonnier kind of spearheaded that. We will get that out to you as soon as that's ready. Hopefully today we'll have that ready for you. And finally, what I have for you is that if you are still missing things, I know we have a few students we've been in contact with, a couple of middle school kiddos, trying to locate their materials. Um, we did that pretty quickly and apologize for um, any things that got mixed up. So if you could do us a favor, if you could take a look at your bags if you haven't done so already, especially middle school students, if you have the wrong things, please let Tara or Christy or or I know um, that, um, that you have someone else's stuff. We'd like to get that to the right people. Also, we're working on getting packets of information to those students as well. Finally, we continue with our shout out to our staff member. Uh, here we go. This staff member has been teaching for 10 years. Her favorite color is teal. She attended UWGB. Um, she taught in Michicot and in Brilliant prior to coming to Reedsville. Favorite meal, have to agree with her on this one, Schwartz's Supper Club in St. Anna. Uh, her favorite song, Chris Stapleton, Millionaire. Uh, her hobbies, camping, running, planting flowers, spending time with her family. Um, 
places that she loves to visit. Nashville, uh, she has recently started camping, so she likes the Oasis Campground, the Evergreen Campground. Um, her favorite book, The Last Lecture by Randy Posh. And as a teacher, she is proud that she's trying to plan engaging lessons with movement and hands-on activities to meet, to ne meet the needs of her students. She's proud to live in the community of Reedsville. With that being said, we shout out to Mrs. Ebert today. Thank you, Mrs. Ebert, for all that you've done for our staff. And that goes out to all of our staff. Thank you for all that you do to make Reedsville a fantastic school district. That, my friends, is all I have for today. Let's have a fantastic day. Thank you.